Hey guys, I want to give a quick thank you to NordVPN for sponsoring this video. I'll be talking about them in the intermission between the two movies. How's it going, Troublemakers? Welcome into another Movie Commentary Monday, where I upload movie commentaries every single Monday. <laughs> we got two movies to watch today. I have to purchase. But you know what? I'm okay with this because we're in the middle of a pandemic and we need to support local business as well as high art. And I believe this movie falls into the latter category. Or is it the former? <laughs> it's got that small business feel while also being high art. Great text. That is a great font, Disney. It's like they choose the cheap fonts for the cheap movies. Do you know that rich looking fonts are free? I'm gonna put one on the screen. Check out this font. Disney, look at this. You know I'm broke. You know I'm broke. <laughs> if I can afford a nice font, so can you. Wicked ways beneath the skin. Okay, I know this is a misdirect. They became good at the end of the first one. Okay, that was cool. <laughs> That's cool. Okay. Nice roll. <laughs> I'm gonna marvel at this CGI. <laughs> All right. You know what? That doesn't look horrible. I'll give him props. Do you guys remember the limo from the first one? <laughs> Take a bite. Come on, people. Come on. Take away. That man relished his role too much. You need to calm down extra. I get that this is probably going to be the only movie you're ever going to appear in, but dial it back. <laughs> I knew it. Oh, you're blonde now, huh? Did you ever think you'd be with a villain, kid? <laughs> We're done here. If his arc in this movie isn't him relishing the fame that comes along with dating an evil kid, then that was the worst line performance I've ever seen. Because he was relishing it. He was like, <laughs> we're done here. That's like someone who's relishing it, but that they're trying to play it off like, I'm not trying to talk about it. <laughs> but yes. <laughs> They turned her mom into a lizard and then let her keep her mom as her pet? This woman is the most evil woman in the entire world. You're gonna let your potentially evil daughter keep her evil mom as a lizard in her room? Mal revealed her love of strawberries. She has received- uh, He seems overbearing. He's like, eat this strawberry. Eat it. Eat this motherfuck- That's right. You don't want to see me angry. He's a beast, isn't he? He's a beast son. Does he turn into a big beast? Oh yeah, he he went full beast. Not full beast, he went half beast in the last movie. He like shouted and stuff. The water and <laughs> Okay, his fit is super solid. In like a really e-boyish way. Super solid. Can you all three? Like getting engaged to be engaged to be engaged. I knew it. Wait, what? This is an engagement? How come nobody told me that? Is my entire life just planned out in front of me? I know. Oh, watch him just creep up. I don't know. Something's not right about this guy. See you later. Okay. Yeah, let her go. Let her go. We'll see how this movie goes, but something is not sitting right. This one. <laughs> not, not a lot, lot of there there. there. Oh, fucking cringe! Because of that, I am rooting against this romance that they're gonna try to force on me. No, 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 no. He started saying it first, too, so I think she was just saying it to placate him. You will not convince me that this smoke show is gonna end up with dork dork number one. I've been doing the numbers. Of course you have, nerd. No wonder people work. Don't touch him. Don't touch him. What am I gonna do with all this money? In the next few years, you could buy that castle you always wanted. Uh, you can buy- Ah! Oh, no! You can buy a castle in a few years just dressing people? Do dressmakers, do they get paid that well in this world? Also, get your f sweaty palms off of me. That way you wouldn't need a prince. You're right, I don't. Because I have you. Ew. You're receptive to him? <laughs> also, are we gonna take in the fact like, hey man, I get it, it's 2020. But his plan is for her to make so much money that she can support him. So she won't need a prince to be in a castle. Ow. I just hit myself. Hi, Mal. Ah! Oh. Hi! Can you back away? Do you not see you're making her uncomfortable? <gasps> what? 
Oh, he's a sugar daddy. He bought her a Vespa. Hey, what happened? Oh, it's Mulan's daughter. Mulan Rouge. I don't know. You should put me on the team. And what's gonna happen next? We'll have girls playing tourney? Come on, guys. <laughs> girls can't do athletics. Section two, paragraph three, 11 4. A team will be comprised of a captain and eight men. Yeah, men. The superior beings, guys. If my mother thought that way, she would have lost the war. <laughs> okay. <laughs> nice to have a friend who's on the same wavelength. Oh, you got me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got me in the friend zone. That dog got some jacked up teeth. I mean, it's Disney. The animals should have like good looking teeth and stuff, you know? Whoa. Okay. I think the acting's bad. <laughs> Don't you ever miss screaming at people and just making them run away from you? You're thinking of my mother, and I was usually on the other end of that, so not really. <laughs> oh, yikes. Man, he needs a supportive female in his life. I just came to use your 3D printer. How'd you get a key to my room? Oh, I printed it off last time I was in here. <laughs> All right. Man, that thing was nasty. I mean, I'm not surprised, but I'm still disappointed. Cause now I know that the fucking budget for this movie went to moving the goddamn jaw on a dog. And while you're at it, scratch my butt. I get it. I get it, it's for our kids. Butts, butt jokes for kids, they're funny. Come on, you scratch your own all the time. Uh... Oh, hello, angry pirate. Yes, please. You are moody, I like it. Do you brood? This movie could use some good brooders. Ursula's son? Who had sex with that woman? Who put their fishing rod into that octopusy? <laughs> This commentary, this whole commentary is worth it for that one joke. Oh, he's got two hands. Wait, why was he wearing a hook? The hook was optional? Bro. Oh. Bruh. Son of Hook. Hook. Son of Gaston and me. Hook, son, I knew it. Ursula's son. I need her to stab somebody. I need to see that she is dangerous. She needs to kill somebody or at least hospitalize someone. Oh, snap. Mom! And remember the name! Sharifi! Kill him. No, kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Oh, they just kicked him out of the bar? So you insult the queen, you just get kicked out of the bar. Okay, cool. Well, I'm really scared of what this girl's gonna do. That's, that's scary. <laughs> you can't take me anywhere, right? Uh, <laughs> I can grab them. Oh, it's her book. It's her spell book. Oh no. Speed reading spell. Blonde hair spell. Cooking spell. Oh, not the cooking spell. Take back this moment that has passed. Return it. Reverse it. Are you trying to spell me right now? Oh, no, she tried to literally erase his memory. How do you trust somebody after that? Return it back to what is real. <laughs> Goddamn grilled cheese in an Oreo. Oh, she's so evil. Did you see her? She just stabbed a box. Let's blow this popsicle stand. Yeah. <laughs> Does it have to make that noise every time it hits the water? Oh, she's going dark again. I'm here for this plot line. Come back and assert your dominance over Irma, or whatever her name was. I was going back to the aisle. Dun, dun, dun. You were just too overbearing and weird, my guy. There was something weird about you. She just couldn't do it. This is my fault. This is my fault. I, I blew it. I mean, instead of being understanding, I just went all beast on her. <laughs> yeah, don't tell us what you did in the bedroom, my guy. His performance was so bad there, too. I hated it. Ah, oh, this is my fault. My girlfriend just left me on the eve of our pre-engagement. Darn it. Arg. Fade to blacks. I hate fade to blacks. If she doesn't stab somebody in the next 10 minutes, I'm gonna lose all respect for her. 
This doesn't look like a place where someone's gonna get stabbed. Fork it over, you run. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Still running errands for Uma? Or... Well, well, well. <laughs> Did he not see this purple abomination standing two feet away from him? She's never gonna give you back your old territory. Oh, he's trying an accent. He's trying to do a little Jack Sparrow-ish type thing, huh? No, dude, stay. The aisle is way too dangerous. They're leaving the dog behind. They probably didn't have the budget to animate it. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Hey! Hey! Stop! Just take it. Oh, great. Now they're gonna go buy drugs. That's why you don't give money to the homeless. Oh, is that a magic carpet? Or it's a trap. It's a trap! It's a trap! It's a trap. Watch out. <laughs> what? what? Oh, I'm so uncomfortable. Also, the fact that you added the, the carpet in the shot. I think that's a hollow floor. Oh, the carpet. Nope. All right. Like a villain. I hate you. Oh my god. No. No. Since my name rhymes with chillin' and villain, I hate anything. Anytime anyone tries to rhyme Dylan and Chillin' and Villain, I know, no, no, no. Those three are not allowed to be rhymed with each other. It's the knee bending thing, bro. This man can't dance. He bends his knees. That's all he does. Watch his knees. He's like, knee bend? Should I just bend my knees like this? Or what do I do? Knees? Knees? All knees. He's all knees. <laughs> his knees collapsed on him. <laughs> He's all knees. <laughs> but it's hard being what I'm not. A good dancer? Wish me luck. No, just go. Jesus. Please come home. This is my home. Homie? I am home. I... <laughs> mm -hmm. I love you. Don't you love me? I wouldn't if I were her. No, no, please. <laughs> She's been cringing away from him all movie. I don't think it's just an internal struggle. I think she just hates him. Ben, please go. Please leave. She's like, what an asshole. I can't believe you left. And if you want to see him again, um, I'll come to the chip shop tonight. Oh, uh, yeah. Sit on that chair backwards. Let her know who's cool here. Bring me fairy godmother's magic wand. And if you blab... You can kiss your baby goodbye. What are you gonna do? Kick him out of your bar? <laughs> oh no! No! Why is it open? I think not only... Not only is this aimed at children, there's no edge to it. Which hurts, because these are villains. And I haven't seen a single person get stabbed. What, what am I here for? You can shake Chad here. I like Chad. Chad's funny. But you can shank him. Uh, why are we making fairy guns? Oh, she's a fighter. They set that up. She's gonna beat a bitch. I thought you forgot. Well, his teeth got so much better. Did you see that dog's teeth? My that dog got veneers. I thought you forgot. <laughs> that dog had some jacked up teeth before. It would make me so happy to know that you were wearing something of mine, Oridon. Almost like me being there myself. Fucking rescue this child! At least one of us had a dream come true, right? That's so sad. I really hope she dies. Like, not for, like, my own pleasure, but that would bring a severe amount of edge to this movie. If you just killed off this girl that I've grown attached to, this sad little girl who's, who's happy, not having anything in life, kill her off. I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> Alright. God damn it. I'm so sick of seeing that shot. That's the third time we've seen a, someone pick up a rock, throw it at the sign, the sign turns. At this point, you can just have her pick up a rock, throw it, and not cut to that, because we know what happens. We can just hear the sound of a rock hitting the metal, and we'd know. <laughs> Why am I giving directing tips? <laughs> also, look at that chair. That chair looks like you would get hepatitis just by sitting on it. Listen to my heart. You can find me in the space between. I never really connected with the first movie soundtrack, and I know people like it, but it's never anything interesting to me. This, though, these, there's some good songs here. Yeah, 
I wish they were lesbians. I wish she was following her heart, but instead of following her heart to evil, oh, kiss, just, just one look quick, okay. Instead of her following her heart to evil, she followed her heart to that bed with. Okay, slow down, Dylan. You're a part of me, so you can- You're a part of each other. In the space between. Yeah, eliminate that space between your faces. Oh. I'm ready for a Disney lesbian princess. You're serious, stay. Why? Why have a whole plot line where the dog talks if you don't take the dog along with you on your adventures? She went camping, sleeping on the ground with no place to plug in a hairdryer. Yeah, maybe you didn't know her as well as you think you did, nerd, nerd one. Dork, dork one, whatever I named you. I'm coming with you guys. She brought like eight swords. Look, it's either you take me or I'm gonna have to tell Fairy Godmother. Nah, don't do that. Come along, kick some ass. I'm ready for it. <laughs> Did that little girl sigh? And that why is that beard so fake? <laughs> sigh, you little bitch. Why? They couldn't cast someone with a real beard. I don't. I don't think that's real, guys. Why does everything look so fake? <laughs> oh, cause it is. Gotcha. Oh, whoa! He jumped, and then like humped. That was a jump hump. Well, I don't like that at all. Look at this. There is no need to jump in the first place and watch him just grind his way up the king. Oh yeah. All right, we got our first gay character. Give it a rest, Harry. Give it a rest. Did he eat a lot of food while he was there? Is that his stomach? Did they put a bomb on his stomach? Why, is he pregnant? I don't know the rules in this place. Maybe she's got spells. Maybe she casted a spell that he was pregnant. You better hope your girlfriend comes through. She's not my girlfriend anymore. Leave us alone, Harry. Oh, oh my God, triangle, triangle, triangle. That would be such good revenge for the uh, Uma because then she'd be like, yo, I saw your mans. What you gonna do, bitch? Go. Yeah, go, bro. That, don't touch my shoulder like that, weirdo. And don't pretend to look out for me because no one's looking out for me. Oh, he's a little sad bitch. It's just me. You little sad bitch. My mom doesn't care about me either. God, you're such a little sad bitch. I guess I was busy being king. That's, that sounds lame. Yeah, so lame, being king. I knew it. How did he open the trunk? How did this dog pop? Uh, you know what? I don't care. Stay. You know that dog's not gonna stay. It's gonna come into play and save someone's ass. They just leave it behind. I'm done with it. I was done with it before it even talked. Mel's power has got to come into play, right? She's been flaring up with her green eyes. Welcome! Finally! <laughs> oh, I like that shot. That was nice, that was good. Welcome! I think he, he's the spectacle, and then she walks in and he walks out. I like that. Tonight, let's go, bring it on. Better give us what we want to take you. How is the beast kid so fucking weak? Why, can you go beast mode? <laughs> That's funny. Okay, look, this is not a conversation. It's a do or die situation. <laughs> this reminds me of like epic rap battles of history, but instead of history, it's epic rap battles of Disney characters. There's kids. <laughs> no hesitation. I'll serve you right here. And I don't need a reservation. <laughs> that way you're uh, whole... Every, all the good stuff I was talking about the, with the music before, yeah, that's gone now. Hey, we don't have to choose whatever. This reminds me of R. Kelly strapped in a closet. This man is singing like an R. Kelly character. <laughs> ah! Bro, let me see a battle. Let's go. Let's go. A slingshot? Okay. Okay. That was worse than the limo in CGI. There's so much swordplay and no one's getting stabbed and it's really hurting my heart. <laughs> Stab him! Oh my. Here, take mine. What a cocky. Wow. If I was fighting someone and they were like, here, take my weapon. Try to kill me with a weapon and I won't have a weapon. And then I couldn't, I would probably be really turned on. I'd probably die because like we're fighting with weapons, but I'd end up dying turned on. So what? <laughs> 
She fights worse than Ben dances. Oh, the shark infested waters. Hook's son. The hook is valuable to him, I guess. They never really hinted at that until the end here, but okay. I thought he was gonna get chased by a shark like his father. Wah. Movie. You can't miss bigger than that. Like, that's the biggest miss you could hit. That's the biggest thing that you. That's right there! It's right there! Jesus. Uma captured you. She's an angry girl with a bad plan. He's into Uma now. Is that recycled? Did I buy the first one? Did I buy it or did I rent it? I bought it. Okay. We can look to see if it's a recycled shot now. Okay. 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 Okay versus... <laughs> and then this is also from the first one. Oh, okay. And Descendants 2. Okay, so the bridge is building. The bridge is building as they're going across it. And here it's already built. So they didn't recycle that part of it. Are you seeing someone else? Oh, Are God. You I hate everything about him. My Uncle Bashful used to say that. He's one of the sons of the dwarves? <laughs> that makes so much sense. Would you? Consider maybe being more than friends. Like boyfriend and girlfriend, we can hold hands instead of slugging each other all the time. No, no. I'm when I said more than friends, I meant like friends with benefits. <laughs> if that's gonna be like the focus of your shot, spend some money and make that look good. He really has top end fashion. Now. Beautiful, my love. But I don't like that she has the wand. That's sketch. Cause this movie's not over. We need another conflict. We resolved it. There's no way we don't have a big conflict. To end this movie. Mom. Bippity boppy. Get it. Oh, um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's like a meme. <laughs> so yeah, bring it up. Bring it up. Uh, yeah, crowd, let's do it. We work it behind. What did he just say? We work it behind. <laughs> you work it, girl? That's a weird thing to say from a character who I've never seen before. Work it, girl. Never tell a d- mm. as, a, as a man in his 40s or later, never tell a teenage girl that you're standing next to, don't just ever whisper in her ear, you work it, girl. Because it's not going to be received well by anyone. How are you? Why is everyone so quiet? I hate this. This is so awkward. I wish I had time to explain. Oh! Dog, don't trust it. We need a conflict. And we've seen the wand. That's his date. That's his date! Love triangle! Oh! <laughs> Fuck you, bitch. He's got a kidnapping kink or something. That really got to him. Something happened to me when I was on the aisle with Uma. The connection. Oh, it's a sp the spell. She got the spell book. Okay. I really want to thank you. <laughs> I do. This is the thing I predicted. She's gonna steal her man. That's such- that's the best revenge. That's the love spell. Wait, the love spell didn't work on him in the first one. That was the love brownie or whatever. The love cookie. Hmm. How are the pieces not getting put together? Oh, cuz you're all idiots. That's- that makes so much sense now. I'm gonna be honest. Visually, they look better together. Let's get out of here. Yeah, get out of here. Unveiling of King Ben's masterpiece, designed especially- Oh, okay. Okay, so he's gonna break the spell because he loves her so much, and then the, the Uma's gonna die for the want. But- Break the spell. The green. The green in the eyes! That's why they hung onto the shot for so long before. It's the green. It's the green in the eyes. Bet, 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 bet. Bet, yeah, bet, Ben did that. Ben's known who I was all along. <laughs> he gave me green eyes. He's known who I've been all along. Uma will be joining the court tonight as my late son. Not now, Dad! Yeah. <laughs> I am your king. Obey him. <laughs> she got some sass. Ben's been spelled. Oh, it took you till now to figure it out? Uma found your spell book. I was here minutes ago, girl. I love you. Oh, he really didn't give any effort on that kiss. <laughs> she just drowned. 
dog. You kissed that thing. Oh, imagine if you got married and you had to have sex and you were like, okay. And then all of a sudden she was just like, and she had like eight legs that wrapped around you. It'd be kind of hot, actually. <laughs> oh, dragon versus octopus. Uh, thank you. This is like the poor version of Kong versus Godzilla. I don't know a lot about boats, but if there is water on deck, I think there's a system in place for it to be drained pretty quickly because otherwise every wave you hit, there's just gonna be water all over your boat always. You got a poor drainage system. Plus half the people know magic. Just zippity zap, water be gone. Kenny Ortega directed this one. He was the High School Musical director. I hope the third one gets the High School Musical treatment. Like the budget's so much bigger. You didn't think this was the end of the story. Are you talking to me? <laughs> we know you're turning good by the end of the next one. Shut up. Took a little break, ate a little snack. It was yogurt. Had some yogurt. You hear that Sour Patch Kids? I don't need you. You need me. Before we step into the third and final Descendants movie, I want to give a big thank you to Nord, who is today's sponsor. If you are not using a VPN in 2020, what are you doing? If you are not using a VPN, all of your online traffic is being monitored. And not only is it being monitored, but they know your IP address, so they can pinpoint where you are. That is where NordVPN comes in. Not only does Nord encrypt all your traffic, but it also tells them that you're in another location completely. So when they try to pinpoint you, you could be in another state, you could be in another country. Maybe I wanna be in Brazil for a second. Let's just connect to Brazil. Yeah, man, <laughs> that's Jamaican. And the great news is they are offering a deal if you use my code, you will get 70% off plus a month free. It's nordvpn.com slash Dylan is in trouble. I'll leave a link for it in the description. Another benefit of having a VPN, there's certain content that's restricted to the United States for licensing reasons. But if you just tell them you're in another country, Brazil perhaps, you will be surprised what your Netflix looks like afterwards. Again, it's just nordvpn.com slash Dylan is in trouble. It's a really good deal. I highly recommend anyone that doesn't have a VPN, go get yourself a VPN. 70% off, that's a great deal. All right, Descendants 3. Let's check this out, man. Uh, what did I just see on the poster? I don't even want to look. Don't look. Don't look. Don't spoil. Don't spoil yourself, Dylan. I saw some flaming blue hair. That is Disney, isn't it? That's Hercules. Still couldn't upgrade the font, huh? Daughter of Maleficent. Maleficent. <laughs> Four more. <laughs> Four at a time, that's it? These streets named after us because we paved the way. <laughs> These streets named after us because we paved the way. You did not. Why four at a time? Is that all you can handle? I feel like you could handle like at least 30. You got pride, raise your bees up high, one of the requirements of being chosen as one of the four kids is that you have to have sick dance moves. Oh my god. Yeah, gather them up. Gather them all up. I want to see how many don't get picked, and I want to see the dejection on their faces. I'm a villain. <laughs> Who wants to go? Only four of you. Everyone's so in high spirits right now. <laughs> Wait till you don't get picked and your life is still crap. Why is that girl getting picked? Her hair is too colorful to not get picked. Hey, daughter Celia, I'm back. Oh, look at that. They did get a budget increase. They made the three flamey. <laughs> <laughs> He better turn into a beast by the end of this one. Oh my God. <sighs> Why are you with this band, dork dork number one with the ponytail? Don't move like that either. Oh, he let his hair loose. It's worse like this. Ah, oh, dog. How did you age 30 years? by just letting your hair down. I guess magic, maybe. Someone might have cast a spell on you. Like the love spell on Ben, the last one, like maybe someone spelled him to just age terribly. <laughs> I don't mind him singing. As long as he doesn't dance. Will you marry me? No! Yes! I love you. 
Ah, are you sure? You see his hair, right? You'd really rather have a BK on the throne than me. She's a dragon. That is a great ally to have. If you told me I had the choice between a queen who can turn into a dragon and defend our borders, or a queen that can dye her hair in cotton candy colors, I would choose the dragon every time. I'm really happy they didn't bring um, Maleficent back into this. I thought they were gonna turn her back from a lizard and make her the villain for the second and third one. You spell Ben to destroy all of Oridon. She's a dra- bite her head off. Speaking of kids, we have some kids waiting on us. Oh, I thought she was gonna say she was pregnant. Speaking of kids, yeah, give me nine months. I'm gonna have a little dragon baby. It's Hades. <laughs> Hades? I knew it with the blue hair. Oh. She's going full dragon? Usually they save all the good CGI for the end of the movie. Or, good. She's stronger than a god. Is she gonna fight this off? <laughs> but why is Ben the king? The old king isn't even dead. He's still in his like mid 40s. Did they skip over that? Why is he king? No, blast him. Yo, help her out. Okay, you tumbled one too many times there, my guy. A lifetime of plans gone. I hope she had genuine view. Nope, okay. <laughs> I wish she had genuine feelings for Ben. Really round out her character instead of like, she's evil because she wanted the crown. But if she actually loved him, but her family also wanted the crown, so it was like a perfect coalescence of their desires. But then it doesn't work out. He finds another girl, and not only does she lose her thing, like his love, but her family's thing. God, that'd be so good. That would be too many dimensions for a shitty Disney movie. <laughs> the picture with a broken frame, I know exactly who to blame. With a broken frame? She <laughs> throws it onto a cushioned couch. At least smash it. Excuse me. Okay. In the first one, can I go to my descendants video? Oh, okay. Okay. Here. So the museum doesn't have any security because all the people who live there are good. How did so many people like this comment? Why have a security guard then? If everybody is good, why put gates on there? And why have a security guard? Why is he here? Why is he employed? Why have security cameras? There's no need to have security cameras if everybody's good. There's There was a break-in. The kids broke in and stole one of the most valuable items in the kingdom. You don't think that you would up your security after that at least? How did that man still have a job? His security's so lackluster. So you're telling me that, oh, that's Maleficent staff, isn't it? You're telling me that in this world, uh, the people on the good island don't have any bad feelings? No, there's never any break-ins ever in the whole kingdom and all the kingdoms. There's not any crime ever. That's so, no, you can't, you can't tell me that. If that's true, then she, this doesn't make sense. Why would she feel like this? Step back and watch them. They literally just leave one of those power, that's like leaving a nuclear bomb just out in the open with a trigger right next to it. Just being like, yeah, we're, it's on display. You could. Could I just Oh wow, that's so powerful. It can turn off one chandelier light. Sick. Maleficent scepter and the queen's crown have been stolen. What do we do? They're looking to the... Why are they looking to her? You made your son the king. You are the former king and queen. Just, I don't understand the succession plan at all. You made your son the king so that he can make the orders and declarations and rules. And then when it comes down to a crisis, you look to his girlfriend. I think that we have to close the barrier forever. You think Ben will love you now, you old hag? I wouldn't. I'm sorry. You shall take us anywhere. She's got to get turned back pretty fast. Because there's no way they're going to want kids looking at this this hag. You don't talk still, right? Carlos, you're going to miss James God damn it. I think they told the actors you're going to hit a wave now. And then they never CGI'd in a wave. Watch this again. Watch this. Ah! Oh, they didn't hit a wave. <laughs> It's like a sleeping spell that always makes you go, uh, ah, oh. I'm me again. Oh, 
I knew it. I knew it. Ah, kids don't want to look at ugly people. That's just true. That's why everyone's so attractive in Disney movies or in any movies. What are you doing here? Hi, Dad. What? Let's dance. How did they make Kingdom Hearts for kids, but even if you're an adult, you enjoyed it, and yet they can't make this with any sort of like serious tone? Mans is a god, and they make him look like a little tiny peanut, little peeny pissing peanut. That's what I would say about these three movies, is if I was gonna add something, I would add the edge to make it more enjoyable for adults in the way that they would enjoy, say, like a Shrek. Like that had a lot of adult humor in it that went over kid's head. This doesn't have any of that. It doesn't have any edge. It doesn't have any people stabbed yet. Sleeping is too good for you. <laughs> Elkhead in Dad's man cave. Oh, he's a beast! I've been waiting for this. He's a beast. I hope he's a beast. Please be a beast. I want to see the CGI beast. It's gonna be so beautiful. <laughs> oh, he's gonna dance. I thought he was gonna fucking slash them. I thought he was gonna swing at them, but instead he's gonna do a dance number because that's what this movie series is. They got you out number one to fifty. I didn't realize your math was so bad. I guess she didn't really have a formal education on the Isle of the Lost. At least in High School Musical, when they were doing like choreography with basketball, every move looked like something that could be done on the court. But watching these armored men go, ha, huh, ha, huh, like when they're like over there, they're like, ha, huh, why, why are you swinging over there? What the hell are you doing? <laughs> ah! I hate this break dancing nights. I hate this so much. <laughs> I think they have to perform a dance move so complex that the that it like breaks the nights or something. Why did they lose? Why are they dead? You know what would be fun? To go rafting down a jungle river. I'd love to see one of those. You guys! Oh, the romance we didn't know we wanted. <laughs> yeah, actually, we don't want it. I really hope they film bad. There's too much hair dye in this shot. <laughs> uh, who's the dude? Doug. Oh, Jesus. True love's kiss. Works every time. Oh, no, let him sleep. Let him, we don't need to see him again. Well, we haven't actually used the L word yet. Oh. Good. No, 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 no. Can we be alone? Yeah, cameraman. Let's leave the room. I don't want to see this. Camera? We can, <laughs> we can, camera. Don't freak out, it's okay, cause for love. One kiss, one kiss, it all comes down to this. What if he doesn't wake up? If he doesn't wake up, they're not in love. Oh, don't wake up. Uh... <laughs> He's still sleeping. Oh, damn. <laughs> you can't be serious. You can't be serious right now. This, no. I, no. Uh uh. Oh my God! Hey! All right. Wait, what? She just squirted on him and he's. Okay, hold on, Dylan. <laughs> you work on your wording. That was a really good idea. Is there an insult in there that I missed? I wanted to thank you. Cringe. <laughs> oh! Think you're on the right track. You're the most boring villain. She's just chilling in one location the entire time. All right. Oh my God, she's so evil. That's not how you do it. You don't... <sighs> Why are you so vicious with it? It's frosting. You can lick it. Sorry, my spells aren't working. Audrey's magic is getting stronger. You, you caused, caused our friends pain and fear. We've, We've had enough. Now disappear. You did it. How many shots 
Do you think they recorded of her just screaming at the glowing rod? Because that's like the third or fourth one they've used. They probably had like 70 or 80. You did it. Yeah, using combined friendship powers. Congratulations, we this get it. This is what I've been talking about. Yeah, we get it! Oh, why are you here, my guy? I made it with my 3D printer. Our names put together. Ew. Go with Jane. We need to find Fairy Godmother. Oh my gosh. We're going to figure out how to undo this. Why did they need to separate to go find the Fairy Godmother? Because just so that they could talk to her statue? <laughs> or, or were they really just getting rid of the unimportant characters? The ones that really we don't care about? Because <laughs> I have a feeling that's it. The kids won't be coming off the aisle. What do you mean? The barrier will be closed for good. Forward on safety. <laughs> You're the king! <laughs> you little... Oh. He's the king. He makes the rules. I don't know if you guys know how kingdoms work with kings, but the kings just do whatever they want, and whatever they want to be the law is the law. And this man is the king, but he's also a little cuck because he just lets the... Not even quit. They're not even married. And he's letting her make all the decisions. You're the king. I actually thought you were brave. You're nothing but a chicken. Celia. Celia! No! Celia! No! Let's go find Gail and leave them all to rot. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I... I thought you were gonna stay. <laughs> Every time they cut to the guys, it just reminds me how little impact they have on the story. Like, they got their own little subplots. He's got... He's into Moulin Rouge and the other kid is like into the other girl. But they don't really have any agency. They don't really do anything for the plot. These two, these two have arcs. They have motives and goals outside of romance. And you lied to Jay. And you lied to Carlos. And you lied to the dog. <laughs> I had no choice! Oh god, I'm here you are alone and you did That's your first thought. Friends and family just got zippity zapped, frozen into statues, and your first thought is I should just sing a song now. Kiss. What? Breaks the spell. True love's kiss breaks any spell. Is that not right? Oma! Stop! Please! Stop! Oregon is worth saving! Help us! You brought this on yourself, Mel. You figure out how to fix it. Let's go. Life is not Oh god, again? Girl. Oh, this is Game of Thrones level stuff. She doesn't stand a chance without the Ember. Do you care? We're stronger together. We're stronger together. I'm right here, Matt. I'm right here, girl. I'm right here. It's been 30 seconds since you were like, no, you figure out your problems. Why? Why the change of heart? I don't... Oh, get the f... Get the f... No! Don't... Your CGI is bad enough without trying to give the dragon tears. My god. You really thought this was going to be cool. A dragon holding a gem. If you said, how is the dragon gonna win the battle to end a movie series? If you said holding a gem that shoots lightning, I would be so disappointed. Ingest the gem, spit hot fire, <laughs> and then that's how you win. But holding a gem, why be a dragon then? Why not just stand there as a human and just be like, zip, zap, zoop, zoink? You know? She can't do anything. She's not she's not like infusing the thing with power to then shoot out. It just it does what it does without Oh god. Throw her off the tower now. <laughs> Mom. Mom. They're so useless. Why did you send them away? They were so useless. They just sat by the statue. They did nothing. Come on, ponytail boy. I can't believe they did nothing with the male characters. That's so disappointing. Which is what people have been saying about female characters for so long. Is that how women felt 
And I'm really sorry that I lied to all of you guys. And you're just trying to do the right thing. Yeah. Hear that, kids? Sometimes lying is the right thing to do. <laughs> it's just the top of his head, too. It's not the side. Shave it. Why wouldn't you make that decision if you know the CGI is just gonna be on the top of the head? Shave the sides of his head and then have it... <sighs> We're almost out. Oh, I'm sorry. Imagine if Hitler at the end just woke up one day in prison and he's like, I'm so sorry. Would you forgive him? Would you just be like, ah, you know what? I think he's actually sorry. Let's just... Let's just sweep this under the rug. Would you do that? I wanted to hurt you both. Yeah, you put everyone to sleep. I mean, it's all reversible. So like, maybe Hitler's the bad comp. Dad. Thank you, and he's gonna smile. I get it. I'm gonna have to miss you all over again. <laughs> I'll talk about it in a second. You know what, I'm gonna talk about it now. This whole movie, uh, all three movies, every scene, I knew it was gonna happen. I knew the arc of not only the stories, but the scenes. And that's a problem. Clarina Borgon. Me too, fancy one. <laughs> <laughs> Where was the joke? What are people laughing at? It's time that we take the barrier down forever. We can't do that. It's up to us, Dad. Yeah, you relinquished power for some weird reason, even though you're fully healthy and fully capable of still being king. The barrier will come down. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Flash forward 10 years later, everything is just ruins. <laughs> it's post-apocalyptic. <laughs> Oh, the, the douchey guy who's been a douche for all the movies is like, yeah, good job. No, why would he be like that? No, I don't believe it. I don't buy it. You, you imperfect, perfect. I love how the people who are just oppressed are, s they're just like gonna go celebrate with their oppressors. Okay, I made jokes, but that guy, I think actually has some moves. Hi. Oh, how quickly the absentee father is forgiven. Grand total of zero people were stabbed. So I gotta give this series an F. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. The second one I liked for what it was. And the third one, I, it just, it had potential. It's the closer, it's the finale. And maybe I have the taste of High School Musical in my mouth because it's the same director, had the same feel with just some magic involved. But the third High School Musical, it was a spectacle. It was shot better. It was just more beautiful. The budget was bigger. This third movie, it just beat beat for beat. Scene by scene, you just saw everything coming, which is disappointing. I want to give another quick shout out to NordVPN for being a continued sponsor on my videos. Go check out the link in the description, and you'll also be supporting my channel when you do. So it's like two for one. Yay. I hope you guys enjoyed this movie commentary. You know what's next. Toodles, guys. Yay.